Dawn, could you stay for a chat? Teacher wants to chat after class? This is always bad. Hmm. I'm sorry to say that at the moment you're failing science. I am trying, sir. Try harder. You've got an essay on paleontology to deliver. Do it well and you will pass. Paleontology? Like... Fossils, like dinosaurs, like yawn. Hmm. The essay is due Monday. Monday? I understand you have a lot of schoolwork on, but that's just too bad. Yes, sir. It'll be finished. <laughs> by Monday, unless I ask for help from Rory. Study, exams, essays, the grotesque stew of student upset. <laughs> what a sumptuous dish. <laughs> Time to stir the pot. studying for hours. I thought you might like a snack. Thanks. No problem. Hold it. You're doing something nice for me? What have you done to it? Please. There's nothing wrong with the food. So what do you want? I'm your stepsister. Can't I do something nice for you without you being suspicious? No. What do you really want? Okay, okay. I need some help with an essay on paleontology. And? Can you... Yes? Help me. So, you want my help? That's what I said. First, you have to agree that you are the lowly pupil and I am the master. In fact, you can call me that. Master. <gasps> Dawn? Dawn, wait! I just want you to beg a little. Cut it out, or you'll be the one begging. Example. Please stop, Dawn. That hurts. All right, I'll help you. I know someone working on a dinosaur fossil dig. Maybe we could check it out. An essay about a fossil dig? That could work. Only one problem. The dig's a long drive away. Simple. We ask Gramps to take us. A fossil dig? Rocks, bones, sand. Fee, fi, fo, fum. I'll virus those bones to make my fun. Oh, look at that. A child. 
called Carefree and Innocent, playing in a sand pit. <laughs> Revolting. A juicy little guinea pig to test my bone and sand virus. Whoopee! This is a great setup. We found some brilliant things. Get a look at this. Wow! The shell of a Mataburrosaurus egg. Check this out, Dawn. Yeah. Wow. A bit of rock. You should be making notes for your essay. Note one. This is going to drive me crazy. Follow me. I've got something really good to show you. Isn't this fantastic? <sighs> Guess what it is? Could it be a... Uh, Rotosaurus? Got it! Follow me! So what was this Rotosaurus like? It was a herbivore. It would have only eaten ferns. It was this country's equivalent of a Brachiosaurus. Wasn't that the largest dinosaur ever? That's right. See, you're learning already. It'll take more than that to get me a pass. Then start taking notes. This is where it gets interesting. I'm glad you pointed that out. We put the bone fossils in plaster for protection, then packed them into cases. Oh! Help! What? Could I have a little help over here? Grass? Be careful, that's a valuable old fossil. What? The skull or Gramps? <laughs> ha ha ha! Now if you don't mind! <laughs> this might not be too bad after all. The perfect ingredients for a cemetery. Why would dinosaurs hang about here? There's not a blade of grass to be seen. But, Gramps, in the Cretaceous era, this was all rainforest. A shallow sea was way over there. A river ran through here from hills there. They were grazing by the river when a flash flood drowned them. They were encased in the mud and fossilized. Wow. Um, want to see the best thing yet? I sure do. This should do nicely. Here's a little virus for you, Rory and Dawn. I'll just send it along. <laughs> Look at that, will you? Dinosaur footprints. Hmm. We think three small dinosaurs were grazing by the river when an Allosaurus attacked them. This large footprint must be the Allosaurus. The small ones must have tried to run around the big Allosaurus to escape. Only half the footprints have been uncovered from the sand. 
Any volunteers? You betcha! Great! I'm in. Another Allosaurus print. Now that's big. Drop here. That quicksand has turned slow. Mm. <gasps> Can you smell what I smell? Slimy, stinky apple. The, the apple, apple man. man. He's around here somewhere. Keep your eyes open. Uh... There. <gasps> what? Those sand dunes were alive. Mirage, Rory. I saw all sorts of things like that in the Egyptian desert back during the war. <sighs> Have I ever told you how I took on Rommel, the desert fox? Plenty of times, Gramps. Well, it all started for me back in 39. Or was it 42? No, that was Pearl Harbor. <laughs> Dinosaur bones. <laughs> First the Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous. Now the Virus Age. <laughs> <laughs> wakey, wakey, dinosaur. I've got a bone to pick with you. <laughs> turn at the oasis and were lost in a sandstorm. And that's how I defeated Rommel. Ah! Look out! Let's get out of here! They're alive! <gasps> it's incredible! It's amazing! Ah! It's, it's hungry! have to worry. We don't? These are herbivores. They don't eat meat. What about that one? Oh, yeah, that's an Allosaurus. It eats meat. Meat? That's us!
I can chew in one bite! Not so vicious now, hey? Oh, you think I made it angry? Just a bit! If there's enough rain, we can trap the dinosaurs here. But how? With bait. What bait? <sighs> Let me guess. It has six legs and three heads and answers to the name of us. <laughs> Over here! This way, on the double dinosaurs! Think of a way to get out of here once we trap them. Or else we'll be trapped with them! I knew there was something missing in the plan. <gasps> we can't climb that! Stop it! Leave this to me! Come on! Mutant Sand! Come out and show yourself! You've been here for 40 million years! No use getting shy now! a good idea. This is ridiculous. You don't scare me, Sand. Your dad was mud and your mother was a pile of bog. Close. Too close. I think I've learned enough about dinosaurs. something by now I'm not surprised you're not like they say you can lead a dinosaur to water but you can't make it think <laughs> uh, uh, stupid dinosaurs 